Much of the movement we detect in the Bay Area takes place near the San Andreas Fault, but many other faults cut through the California coastal region, forming a complex network of fractures. The Hayward Fault runs nearly parallel to its more famous neighbor to the west. The Hayward accounts for a portion of the movement between the Pacific Plate and the North American Plate, and it has shifted only slightly since its last great earthquake in 1868. What might an earthquake look like along the Hayward Fault? Scientists use computers to simulate such an event. This simulation depicts one scenario, one possibility. If 50 miles of the fault were to rupture, it would lead to an event about 1 16th the intensity of the 1906 earthquake. The resulting ground movement depends on many local details. Scientists take into account the proximity of mountains, the type of soil, and other factors to calculate the shaking intensity. 